Hey guys, welcome back. So we are in Cape Disappointment at Bellevue's little viewpoint. I think that's what it's called. So we've been here before, but I wanted to come again since I'm in the area and check it out. I have my little pup with me, so we're gonna go and explore the area. Hey guys, back out in Mother Nature once again. We're at this one cool spot here that I've been before called, I think it's called Bellevue's Trail. Ooh, look at this. Again, just another beautiful spot. I absolutely love it. There's another person coming down this way. How cool is that? So, we're just walking. Guess who I ran into again? I ran into that same guy from my last hiking trip. How cool is that? Or my last hiking spot, I should say. You want to check this out? Come. Put up. Not over there, buddy. Let's check out this cool thing over here. Wow. Cool, huh? <laughs> what are you doing? This is leading the way. Hold on, buddy. A nice view. Look at that view. Gorgeous. Dogs can give me a mini heart attack. You can hear just how powerful the waves are. This guy literally ready to jump off. You can also tell how powerful the waves are in this area. You can just hear them clashing. They're so strong. To figure out how you could go down there. I guess there is a way because I would love to explore down there. Oh, okay, I found the way. Okay, so there's this little thing. Where is this? This would be a cool Airbnb. Cool. Let's go. Let's go up this way. Oh, 
what leads to the upper level. Okay, off we go to continue the hike to the view. Let's go. Good boy. <laughs> How many levels is this place? Another entryway to this one spot. Wow. Here we are. You guys ready? So many people. So many people. So I've got the spot to myself, you can see it's extremely beautiful, the waves are strong. I met like, I think they were a family, an older couple and I think two daughters or something. Um, they said they were from Colorado, at least the two ladies said that. But very pretty area, very friendly people too watching the waves here they said there's an eagle on the furthest mount, uh, tree over there which I wouldn't be surprised there is a lot of eagles in this area gorgeous out here. My dog's getting impatient, of course. If he's not moving, he is not happy. I don't think he likes this real thing because look, it's not too bad though, but I don't think he likes this, so we're gonna just get out of here, I guess. It's so beautiful out here. Being out in nature. Amazing. Gorgeous. Watch this step, bud. Do you like this area? Good boy. I definitely want to take a cool picture somewhere here. I don't know. Now that's where I want to go look. Get up. Let's go. Beautiful. There was ever a zombie apocalypse or whatever that would be the perfect place to be yes it would just so alert about everything we are almost getting to the parking lot of this area we're back at this tree with a cool stump So then 
next spot we're headed to is called Waikiki Beach. Let's go. Still in Cape Disappointment. Here we go. Wow, it's so sunny. Oof, I don't know how we're gonna get there. There's no way to go down there. <laughs> kind of muddy, so I didn't want to get my feet soaked. Or anything like that. This is a cool spot. There's dogs. Where are you going, Zeus? Oof. Okay, nice. Alright guys, I think we are done for exploring today. I just had an amazing time. Like every time I go out in nature, it's just so soothing to the soul. It's just exactly what I needed. And I'm in love like nature is so beautiful just being out there even though I go on most of these trips like 90% of the time I go on these trips by myself it's still nice because like I'm not completely alone out there like you know I'm always running into somebody like always running into people and I you know say hi to them or sometimes we'll stop and have like a little small conversation and then you know continue our merry way but there's just so many friendly people in this area and I'm just so thankful to be here because there's a lot to see in this world. There's a lot to see. You know, I've been at the state park a bajillion times, but I haven't even still to this very day, to this very moment, I still haven't fully explored everything. There's lots of trails and nooks and crannies and everything that I just haven't had the chance to explore. But nonetheless, I'm just so happy and excited to just be able to, you know, get out here. So if you guys ever have any free time or something, go spend time in nature. Just go out rather be to the beach maybe beach is kind of naturey like at least you're still outside but you know the beach or like somewhere in the woods hiking or just even if it's just to go sit somewhere in the forest where it's peaceful and quiet just do it it's so soothing to the mind and soul and it's amazing so hopefully you guys will be able to do that and you know make time for that because it's amazing and you meet amazing people on the road too yeah so I'm not hungry right now surprisingly like I'm a little bit hungry but not too hungry I might have some snacks in here or something that I can munch on I don't know if I do or not but I might just go and grab something to eat here shortly because it's about that time where I should be eating something anyways yeah if you guys enjoyed today's video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't and let me know what you guys want to see next bye